Swami Vivekananda was a renowned scholar, thinker, saint, and philosopher of India. Swami Vivekananda was born on 12th January 1863 in Calcutta, present Kolkata. The people of India celebrate National Youth Day on 12th January to commemorate the birth of Swami Vivekananda. He was born into an upper middle class aristocratic family of the Kayastha caste in Bengal. Vishwanath Datta, his father, was an attorney at the Calcutta High Court, and Bhuvaneshwari Devi, his mother, was a PS lady. The personality and thoughts of Swami Vivekananda were highly influenced by the sensible attitude of his father and religious disposition of his mother. His early names were Bile and Narendra Nath. From his boyhood, he was very bold but naughty. Young Naren had his education at the Metropolitan Institution at Calcutta. He passed his examination and graduated from an English college. He passed his PA examination and then proceeded to study law. But after the sudden death of Narendranath's father in 1884, his family's poor financial position did not allow him to prosecute further study. He was an excellent singer. One day, Ramakrishna Paramahamsa happened to hear him singing a devotional song. He asked the young man to see him at the Kali temple. Narain was very keen to see God face to face. The meeting of Ramakrishna with Narain came as a turning point in his life. As time passed, Narain had that wonderful heavenly experience in his life. He became the most dedicated disciple of Ramakrishna. Later, in 1886, after the death of Guru Ramakrishna, Narendranath and eight other disciples took monastic posts. According, according to the verse, they decided to live their life as their Guru did. Narendranath took the name of Swami Vivekananda and started traveling all across the world. Speeches and lectures all over Europe made him one of the best orators of the time. From 1888 to 1893, he traveled all across India, and on 31st May 1893, he started his journey to the West. In the same year, he presented his world-famous speech at the Parliament of Religions at Chicago, where he addressed the audience as the Sisters and Brothers of America. Swami Vivekananda, on 1st May 1897, established the Ramakrishna Mission in Bilur which is working at a present day, engaged in providing voluntary aid to the people in need and the poor people. The main aim of the Ramakrishna mission is Atmanu Makshartham Jagat Hitaya Chha, which means soul salvation can be attained by serving mankind selflessly and unconditionally. The teachings of Ramakrishna mission encourage Vedantic philosophy and where it worked for instilling the spiritual aspect in the society. Swami Vivekananda's teachings of Vedantic philosophy and philanthropic ideas not only inculcated the Indian youth to uh, work for the welfare of the society, but also instilled in them the fear, the love and sacrifice for the country. With a lifespan of fewer than 40 years, he inspired the youth to fight against social issues like Tyrannian society, Women of Clifton's untouchability, poverty, illiteracy. Swami Vivekananda, besides being a social reformer and a philosopher, was a monk of power excellence. This made him leave an epoch mark in history. In a life journey of a monk, traveling from the Himalayas to the Kanyakumari, he mixed with all people of all classes and treated them with humility and love. And this gave him a great place in the heart of those people and he left an important footprint in history. On 4th July 1902, he left for heavenly abode, and, but his unique contribution continues to awaken and enlighten us till this day. Thank you.